a lot of times you need to take a screenshot in Windows 10. Let's look at the different options available so you can pick one that works best for you. One of the easiest way to take screenshot in Windows 10 is to press print screen button on the keyboard. Windows takes screenshot into the clipboard and then you can access it by pasting it into a different application. For example, if you launch Paint in Windows 10, I already pressed the print screen button. You can uh, just paste it and you see the screen print right in the Paint application. Same way you can paste it into Microsoft Word or any other application that can bring in uh, pictures from the clipboard. Alternative way to take screenshots in Windows 10 is by using Snipping Tool. You launch Snipping Tool by type Snipping. You type Snipping Tool by using a Start button in Windows 10. You launch it. Here you can create new snipe by clicking the New button. And Snipping Tool allows you to select specific area in Windows 10 which you would like to screenshot. The difference between Snipping Tool and the Print Screen button is that Print Screen always takes a full screen and Snipping Tool allows you to make a selection. Once you take screenshot, you can copy it by clicking Edit Copy or using a keyboard shortcut and you can paste it into a different application. I, I will be using WordPad uh, to paste it. So to launch WordPad, you type WordPad in Windows 10 Start menu. It launches WordPad and then here you just use Paste button and it pastes that snipe that we just took using Snipping Tool. One of the new ways to take screenshots in Windows 10, which was recently introduced, is a tool called Snip and Sketch. You can launch it by using keyboard or just launch it in Windows Start menu. To launch it in Windows Start menu, you type the name of it, Snip and Sketch, and it shows up as one of the applications. And here you can just use a, a new snip. You select the area, paste it into the editing uh, application where you can highlight it. From here you can copy it by using the copy button and then you paste it into another application. For example, WordPad. Once copied into clipboard, it could be pasted into any application that has access to clipboard, which is pretty much any Windows application. Sometimes you may need to take a screenshot and have it saved into the file system. Windows provides a shortcut to accomplish this in one step, using Windows key and print screen button. To take screenshot and save it directly into the file system, you click Windows button and uh, holding Windows button push print screen. You see the screen flashes for a second and then you navigate to the folder um, and you go to pictures and here Windows created screenshot subfolder and here you see your screenshot. If this video was helpful, make sure to click the like button in your browser. Also, please help your friends to learn this topic faster by sharing this video with them. And if you would like to be the first one to know about new videos to help you reach your goals faster, make sure to subscribe to my channel. Make sure to check out my other relevant videos and subscribe to my YouTube channel. We have a lot of great stuff planned in the pipeline and I don't want you to miss any of it. And if you'd like to get notified about all the new stuff that are coming out, make sure to subscribe to my email list as well. All links are here on the screen. Make sure to click to stay in touch. Thanks again for watching.